Happy spring, everybody. I hope you're doing great. Welcome back, and I don't like Mondays, so I wanted to do something fun for Monday. So, you might have all this at home. So, I tried to make this. This is gonna take you like five minutes, but it's the cutest project. It's a spring project, and it's either a brooch, or it's a magnet for your fridge. And I loved it. I've done these before and they're a hit. You know, I'll give them out or I'll put them, I'll, I'll, you know, I put them in a gift basket or I attach them to an Easter basket and they look so cute. I did this one time for the office fridge with everybody's pictures and they loved it. Everybody was laughing and they wanted it. You know, they were like, well, I'm taking mine home, you know? So, you know, it's just a brooch or a magnet. So come on over and look at this cute project and, you know, try not to spend any money because I think it's gonna cost you a dollar if anything. And you, you know, like I tell you, look around, see if you have this, but I want to do a shout out. Everybody's been so great. You know, you're great. You know, you're great. So, uh, let's see. Jazzy Slots. Oh my gosh. I remember seeing her on someone's video and then I noticed her name the other day on a chat and I thought, I remember her. She was in Granny's uh, video last year or I think it was, um, uh, let's see, Lucky Dog Slots over at El Cortez. I remember seeing her. So when I, I noticed that, I said, I'm gonna put her on here. So Jazzy Slots and Stacy's High Limit Slots. Stacy's great. I watch her every day and she's doing a purse giveaway. She's gonna do a kind of a drawing for a purse. So a high-end dollar purse. So anyway, get on her site and she needs the numbers. You know, she, she was trying to get up there. She's got a goal. So anyway, and Melly loves slots. Melly. That was great on Saturday, so much fun. Oh my gosh, I enjoyed it so much. I had to run out and get something to eat real quick, but I came back and I was still watching. So you're doing great, and if Melly gets her number, she, if she gets up to 1,000, she's going to Vegas. So, you know, I want her to go to Vegas, so help her out. Help her out, subscribe, whatever you can. And Slot Hustler, she just recently came over and watched my stuff, and I said, well, I'm gonna watch your stuff, because, you know, I want, take me along, you know, show me what you're doing. So I like seeing people win. So anyway, check out these people. Very sweet. And uh, come look at this crazy little craft today. So anyway, this is so easy, guys. Uh, these are these glass beads. This is what's probably going to cost you a dollar. You know, they come in a big bag. They're just glass beads. Nothing to them. And all you're going to do is you're going to take a picture or you're going to take something out of a magazine. You know, in these magazines, we have all kinds of cute pictures or colors. Look at that. You could use the colors right here or... You could use an Easter bunny, or you could use this let it be, you know, any kind of little thing. I have a picture here, my husband and I, we went to a wedding. This is so weird. This is so, it's funny. It's these kind where you sit in the booth, and we got these pictures done. And this is back in 2013, 14, and we, at this, this wedding was so beautiful. It was so over the top at a big hotel. You know, you got to put on funny hats and go sit in the booth and get your picture done. Free bar, you know, and it overlooked this beautiful, you know, waterfall and everything. And guess what? They did, they got a divorce in a, in a, I think six months. I almost fell over when I heard. I couldn't believe it. I was like, what? <laughs> but anyway, she won't be watching this channel, so I can tell you all that. But anyway, I was shocked. I was like, all oh, that wedding? I was like, oh my God, that wedding was so great. But anyway, I'm going to take this little picture, and I'm going to go ahead and put it on a glass bead today, and I'm going to put it on a brooch. and Or I think I'm going to hang it on my fridge, because I, I'm not liking what's on my fridge. Just a bunch of papers and, you know, passwords and all that. I'm like, uh I was like, I got to get rid of that stuff. I was like, I got to put some pretty stuff out there. So... I started with this one, let it be, and I already glued it on here. And all you have to do is either get the clear glue, this clear fingernail polish, or if you have white. I didn't have the white stuff, I had the purple. You don't want that. Use the clear glue. Cause you know, that's a good thing about glue. It dries clear. So use that. And all you do is once, you know, get your, put your glue on there and then let it dry. And, and you know, get the kids involved in this. Cause this is so easy. They could do this. You can make this a Mother's Day gift, in fact, or an Easter gift. If, uh, if you know, you're, you know, Granny, if you're a, you know, gambling Granny, she has a little daycare. This would be so easy for the kids. And this is a pretty gift because if mom's going to church and you don't get a corsage, you know, you wear this. Look how nice this is. You know, I have a pin on today, but this looks so great. You know, it works in a pinch. You know, you're going out, you're going to dinner on Easter Sunday. And some people are going out now, so that's good. That's good. Some people have their shots, so you can go out. 
So all you're gonna do is you're gonna take the bead after you have your little picture on here, and here's some bunnies. I'm also doing the bun, did I already do it? No, no, here, let me do this one first because I've been thinking about this one. But do the bunny rabbit, do flowers, do colors, or you know what, if you don't have a picture and you don't wanna do a picture, put some glitter on there. Glitter would be so cute. I thought I liked that. Okay, here we go. I'm just gonna dot it on here. Whoops, I did too much, too much, too much, too much. Hold on. Okay, there. Okay, and then all I do, I've got my picture right there. That's the funny one right there. And we had these goofy hats on at this party. And I was thinking at this wedding, and I was thinking, oh my gosh, this is the most beautiful wedding. So, you know, we had such a great time, and I saved all the little pictures. So there's one right there. So that's that's the easy way to do it. And then you cut around it when it get, you know, when it's dry. But here's the one, like I tell you, that I I had already done, you know, I'd already glued and, and you know it's all dry. So you take your little flower, and you can work with any flower you want. I did this one on a carnation, a fake carnation. It's a little Gerber flower, but then you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna glue it in the middle. And I'm gonna make this one into a magnet because I like the way it looks, let it be. I just like everything bees. Oh, and remember I was telling y'all about artwork and cheap artwork? This thing behind me, I loved it. It said, be happy, and it's got a big bee, and it's a bath mat. Or it's a, it's a little rug. And I, I looked at it, I thought, I can't put that on my floor, it's too pretty. So I hung it up, you know, I'm using it as artwork, and I loved it. So anyhow. That's just hilarious, so I thought. Oh, Lisa, real quick, I'm looking at her stuff. Thank you for the present. You're adorable, thank you. You didn't have to do this, I appreciate it. And she sent me patches and everything, and I might do a denim jacket in a couple of weeks because I don't like a white denim jacket, but I happen to have one, and I think I'm gonna decorate it. So thank you, Lisa. You didn't, like I tell you, you don't have to do that. So here's my bee, here's my little, here's my little glass disc. All I did is put glue. Put it in the middle there, let it dry, and you can either attach your pin. These are at the dollar store, these little pins, and if you can't find them there, they're at Michael's for $139. You get tons of them. You get like 10 or 12. And the magnets, they're at the dollar store. Dollar store has magnets now. And if you don't wanna go out, the back of these little pads that we get, these little notepads, they have magnets, use that, recycle this stuff. You're gonna throw it away anyway. You might as well make use of it. You know, save this stuff. Look, I'll go ahead and use one right now. And I'm just gonna go ahead and I'll cut it in a square. This one's really thick, so maybe that won't work. Okay, yeah, there it is. Okay, and just make a square out of it. And then I'm gonna attach it to the back. That's going to be a little bit high. So trim down, guys, as much as you can, and then go ahead and then just put your magnet. Let me trim it up a little bit more so it doesn't look so. So anyway, I hope everybody's doing great. Everybody's been, your videos are great, guys. I've been following you all along. Everybody's doing awesome. Keep up the good work. We all enjoy watching. There it is. So easy. Look at that. You just attached a magnet to it. You got your little bee, you got, you know, whatever you want, the artwork you have on a glass piece, you're gonna attach it to the flower on front, you know, just right in the front. So either grab a picture, grab a magazine, or grab something you like, or glitter, like I tell you. And you know, you don't even need a paintbrush for this. If you wanna spread your glue out, use a Q-tip. Super easy, there's nothing to this project. I just wanted to show y'all I feel guilty it doesn't last long enough, but I do I do want to say I have some uh, projects coming up. I want to do a hat box shelf. I've seen these shelves that are on walls, and they're nothing but a hat box. And, you know, I'm not going to buy one. When I have several hat boxes around here, I can make my own. And I want to do a denim jacket because I don't like a, you know, I don't like a plain denim jacket. And I ended up with two, and they're sitting in the closet. They, they're going to sit there, and I'm going to try to make them pretty. So I'm going to try to bling something out. And, you know, that that's, I'm probably gonna, I don't know, maybe in a couple of weeks I'll do that when I'm trying to stick to Easter and spring right now. But so many projects, so many things. So try these out, you know, grab the kids, grab your fake flowers, grab your glue, and this is the only thing you're gonna have to buy is are these little, these little cheap, you know, whatever, these glass beads right here. So <laughs> I appreciate y'all coming by to see this. Like I tell you, this didn't take more than five minutes, so. Get a look, see if you can do this, and 
let the, oops, let the kids help. So thanks guys. Thanks for stopping by today. Okay. Have a good week.